Everton fan showing up to get his seat before the game. Picks his nose. What does he do? Wipes it. <laughs> Everton fan showing up to get his seat before the game. Picks his nose. What does he do? Wipes it. <laughs> Shred. Shred. Yo. This money done got a nigga like me in trouble I made the niggas hate it, leave me dead, they would love to Mommy, before I walked up out that door, I said to hug you Who's my real friend? Seems I'm living in a bubble For crying like a bitch, nigga, get your fucking fire on Got me blowing hollow tips right at your Teflon Nigga, stick and move if you ain't getting stepped on No hate, that's like a cop without his vest on He bugging, constantly thugging We ain't showing no loving Ice grilling and slugging Face the repercussion Nigga's stomach is touching It's real, not for nothing Keep faking and fronting, you know it's gonna be something They say you live and you learn, niggas never would learn Burn, heavily burn, with streets of music merge Niggas coming at me sideways, nigga get your hammer and let's do this the right way for real You know we pop those things What it do folks, Permanent Patriot Looking at some, I wouldn't say future technology Cause they got most of this stuff already <laughs> But uh, well it's new to you anyways right all right. Sustainable floating cities, which they already have in Dubai and other places in the Middle East. Dubai floating city. Boom. You know what they did here? Took all the, that they took all that sand out. That's all they did. Okay. It's called uh, Noah's Ark. Uh, offers refuge on water. If ever a natural catastrophe or warfare were to plague the country. To protect against harsh sea winds or tsunamis, the city could also feature 210 feet tall walls. Kind of like the one that's around the whole fucking earth right now. Except a little bit shorter. Drone ambulances. Need I say more? High speed capsule tube transport. Which is what they have underground. There's at least one that goes from the west coast to the east coast, like LA, actually, like San Diego, uh, Philadelphia type shit, uh, in about an hour. Yeah, they already got that. So in the future, you're going to be able to take 354 mile trip from LA to San Francisco in 35 minutes, which is what they're supposed to be coming out with now. Tesla Motors. Don't fuck with Tesla. Even though they're, I don't, I don't know. I gotta look in a Tesla company. 3D print your own prosthetic limbs. Amputees often complain that their prosthetics look robotic. As a consequence, they're never entirely comfortable with it. So, the new models look more attractive and they fit a unique physique. Yeah, psychologically it helps, duh. Tidal wave powered home. They're calling it a houseboat. Uh, calls it a house. Oh, you see, because he's going in. Yo, for real, I'm about to murk this dude. For real. What is fucking. What is. Fucking, uh, card that he has in his, his spokes. He's got some shit on his fucking muffler that makes his tire sound like fucking ridiculous. I don't mean like hot rod, I mean just stupid. And he rouses the whole fucking neighborhood 
constantly. And I'm about this close. Well, he's about this close to not having a car. And I'm about that close from busting him one. Uh, bah, bah, bah. Sustainable energy source. But they do have a lot of potential to generate electricity. Duh. They also operate high efficiency as they symbiotically, symbiotically with wind and solar energy. Yeah, I already got those in Arizona. Spiraling underwater cities. Which, there's about four or five of them they are testing, as far as I know. <laughs> I mean, I uh, hope to capitalize on the potential of the deep sea by building an underwater city that could house 5,000 people. Uh, the glass domed city would measure 500 meters in diameter and link air, sea surface, and deep sea with the ocean floor. Just all of a sudden, right? We can't go down a certain depth. And now all of a sudden, oh, we got fucking cities down there and shit. I think they haven't fucking been to the bottom of the ocean. Eons ago. My head's starting to hurt. <sighs> the structure would be built to safeguard against typhoons, earthquakes, and temperature change. Now we get into some cool shit. Aircrafts with train like pod legs. <laughs> so it's kind of Sky State. This is from Sky Station. And I'm looking into these guys. I've been looking into them for like a week. They got some. Well, I'll be covering that. But it's called Skyship. And it's got pod like trains. I pick up passengers, luggage, and even fuel so that the aircraft would never have to land. The plane's wings could be optimized for flight, improving flying efficiency and shortening travel time. Can you say the Jetson? <laughs> Honey, I'm home. I already got these. Energy producing vertical farm towers. Also, Middle Eastern countries. Qatar, Dubai, I already have these. United Arab Emirates. So, vertical farming. Uh, wind turbines, solar cells, and vegetation will ensure the building produces more energy than it uses. Have a like section will offer a different experience. Homes, offices, shopping centers, shit like that. You know, just fucking cities up in the sky. Hey. Twenty two reasons why we're already living in the future. Yeah. You can go to that. Fucking love this idea. Windowless airplanes. Panoramic views. <laughs> so, window, windowless fuselage. Yeah, plastophobic. Yeah. Windows would be replaced with high definition flexible display screens. Using cameras, exteriors of the plane could be broadcasted. Or colors associated with sunsets and sunrises could be screened. Without the weight of the material required to reinforce windows, planes would use less fuel, producing less carbon dioxide, and possibly reduce the cost of air travel.
Hello. McFly. And then, uh, you know, you get different types of shit here. Baba Mail. Baba Mail. Okay. Baba <laughs> Mail. Hey, sheeple. Alright. So, we recommend down here. Future of Warfare, Anger, or Futuristic Weapons. Artificial Pancreas, may hold key to diabetes. God's Fingerprint, the amazing pattern behind creation. Yeah, I was doing a little, I watched a few videos on this, and apparently, human beings are the only thing in the fucking universe that have fingerprints. God did that for a reason. Remember that. Now folks, I told you that they, the elite said that they're actually the Hunger Games Avatar Elysium, those are real. They plan on that shit. Look. Just check that out, first of all. And then look. Future is now. These inventions prove it. Uh, 14 incredible inventions of 2015 that will blow your mind. Haven't even gotten to 2016 yet. There's another one down there. A word, though. How many times I tell you people the elite are using fucking iPhone 25s and shit? Already got. Look. Look. Nah, you can't have that. Probably not for another 30 years. Want your own personal flying vehicle? Check out that car. Want to see that? I'm going to be looking more into this too. The cars. Kind of looks good. Meet George Jetson. <laughs> That's when they had it. Star Wars. Oh, see this? Like a fox, son. Window turn door is opaque whenever you lock it. Never seen that in movies? They had that in government for years. Since the early 90s, anyways. Translate science from video in real time.
stop sign using water to project the image. 